In this video, we will see a step-by-step -step demo of creating a two-zone display with PySignage in a screen oriented in landscape mode using layout 2A. Before continuing here, please read the article on all the pre-built two-zone display layouts available in PySignage in landscape mode and the dimension of each zone. The link to the article is given in the video description below. To summarize here, layout 2A has two zones, a bigger main zone to the right and a smaller side zone to the left. For a Full HD 1080p display, the dimensions of bigger and side zone are 1440 into 1080 pixel and 480 into 1080 pixel respectively. The dimensions differ if you are using a 720p screen. The image or video assets designed for 1080p setup will fit in a 720p setup as both 1080p and 720p screens have same aspect ratios. And even when the image or video assets you have are not of the exact dimensions needed for the layout, you can always use the fit screen feature in PySignage to adjust output. Link to the article on fit screen feature in PySignage is given in the video description below. Also, please note that layout 2B is a mirror image of layout 2A. That is, the layout 2B will have a bigger main zone to the left and a smaller side zone to the right. Procedure for creating a playlist in both layouts are exactly the same. They just give you a greater control over how you want your display. Here, we are proceeding under the assumption that you have the required assets uploaded in your account. There is a separate video on different types of assets in PySignage and how to upload them in your account. Link to the video is given in the description below. Now, let us create a playlist in layout 2A. Go to the playlist section in your account. Enter the name for a new playlist you want to create. We will create a playlist called 2A Demo Playlist. Click on Add. Now an empty playlist is created and you can see all the assets in your account that can be added to this playlist. You can also open an already existing playlist and edit it. Let us go back to the empty playlist we have created that is 2A Demo Playlist. You can see among the assets listed none are part of the playlist. Now, since we want to create a playlist for a layout 2A display, first let us define the layout. Click on layout box in the top right corner. Note that the default layout is layout 1, that is single zone display in landscape mode. In the pop-up box that opens, choose layout 2A. Click on done. Now the layout is set as 2A, we will start including assets in the playlist. Tick the select box on any asset you want to be a part of this playlist. Remember, this asset you have selected will be displayed in the main zone. You can use the filter by name option if you know the name of the assets you want to include. This may be better possible if your uploaded assets have a naming convention. For example, in case of image assets, we know the dimension required here are 1440 into 1080 pixel. So we will enter 1440 in the search bar to see if there are any assets of that dimension. Again, this is only possible when the assets have a set naming convention. We can see results filtered on search and appropriate assets can be selected. But even then there can be a lot of assets and the process can be tedious. So the best way is to create a category with an appropriate name and assign all the assets for a specific use case to that category. Later, you can easily access all these assets by using filter by categories feature. Link to the article about categories feature in PySignage is given in the video description below. So here let us click on filter by categories button at the top. A pop-up page opens having all the categories created. Here you can see a category called main 2A 14401080. As the name suggests, I have created this category to contain assets suitable for main zone in layout 2A. That is with dimension 1440 into 1080 pixel. Select the category required and only the assets belonging to that category will be listed. Creating proper categories for assets makes it easy to manage large accounts. Now let us come back to selecting assets for the playlist. Irrespective of whether you have used filter or not, procedure for creating playlist remains the same. Select any asset you want to be part of this playlist by ticking the box. When selected, you will see further options visible. At the right side, you have to enter the amount of time this asset has to be displayed. The entry is in seconds. Let us enter 15 seconds. Below the time entry, you will have a box for entering text in case of image or video assets. 
The text entered here can be displayed as a ticker on top of that asset. We will see about tickers in a separate write-up. Now below the asset name you have two buttons. First we will learn about side button. We use this button to select the assets to be displayed in the side zone. Let us click on it. A pop-up page opens. You can select an asset for side zone or you can select a complete playlist for a side zone. First let us see about selecting an asset. You have filter by name option even here. So always uploading assets with some sort of naming convention will help you in managing your account. Particularly if you are managing a big account with lot of assets and groups. For the layout to your display, side zone dimensions are 480 into 1080 pixel. Let us choose an asset of this dimension and click on done. Now you can continue this process of creating the playlist by selecting some more assets. Once the playlist is prepared, deploy it. Your two zone display will be running. Now let us go back to the side button. We chose an asset previously. Now click on playlist tab. Along with assets, you also have the option of selecting a complete playlist for the side zone. You should have an appropriate playlist ready beforehand. You even have the filter option available here. You can see a playlist on screen named 2A side width 480x1080. I have created this playlist containing image assets of dimension 480 into 1080 pixel. So this playlist perfectly suits the side zone of layout 2A. Select a playlist, click on done. The playlist selected for side zone will run as long as its main zone asset is displayed. So if you want the complete side zone playlist to be played, make sure you have entered long enough display time for main zone asset. The flexibility here is we can create a playlist where side zones are a combination of assets and playlists. In the playlist on screen, you can see a JPEG image asset in the side zone and also a playlist. Once again, let us go back to the side zone playlist option. Here, after selecting the playlist, if you tick on the option play independently, this playlist will keep playing in the side zone continuously, ignoring all other assets assigned for the side zone. Only the assets of main zone in the playlist will be loaded one after another. Their respective side zones will be ignored. In the playlist above, the side zone playlist named 2A side width 480x1080 is selected to play independently. In the image of the playlist above, it is highlighted as side zone 2 for our convenience. In above case, all the main zone assets named main zone 1, main zone 2, main zone 3 and main zone 4 are played for their respective time. In the side zone, only side zone 2 playlist is played in a loop and all the other side zone assets 1, 3, 4 are ignored. Now that we have covered filling side zones, let us see the other button, show full screen. As the name suggests, when you select this option, your main zone asset will occupy the full screen. Even if there is a side zone assigned to the main zone, it will be ignored. Again, while using this option, it is advisable to make sure you select the main zone asset of appropriate dimension. So, by using this feature, you can have a screen with a combination of single zone and double zone displays, giving a greater control over your display. Remember that selecting show full screen option will also overrule side zone playlist that you want to be played independently. That is show full screen option gets first precedence. Once the duration of main zone asset to be shown in full screen is complete, the side zone playlist to be played independently will reload and resume display. Once the playlist is ready, deploy it. An engaging two zone display is ready. On screen, you can see a sample two zone display for a restaurant menu signage use case. Reach us at info at for any queries.